Now to the premiere of the new documentary called She here at the Strand Center Theater this past weekend. It is the first feature length film for Plattsburgh filmmakers Jason Greer and Vanessa Ciccarelli, based on the book of poetry by Plattsburgh State Professor Amy Baker, who has written about some of the thousands of Jane Doe's, women who are missing or whose unidentified remains have been found. The film premiered this past weekend at the Strand, and among the guests were two representatives from the DNA Doe Project, a national nonprofit that uses investigative genetic genealogy to identify John and Jane Doe unidentified remains. Over the past few years, the group has become the go-to organization many law enforcement agencies and medical examiners have turned to to help them solve their most difficult cold cases. Jennifer Stone Randolph and Karen Binder from DNA Doe Project talked with the audience before the premiere about what the project does and how it's helped to identify two of the women that Amy Baker profiled in her book, Doe. DNA Doe Project is a nonprofit organization with a simple humanitarian mission to restore names to the tens of thousands of unidentified individuals known as John and Jane Doe's. Since its inception in 2017, DNA Doe Project has successfully identified more than 80 previously unidentified people by, uti by utilizing investigative genetic genealogy. We thank Amy Baker and those involved in the creation of She. Every Doe has a human story and a life lived. Amy's work provides the Doe's with the voices that they so deserve before they are identified. We're pleased to have the opportunity to share our work as it integrates so closely with Amy's. Some of the proceeds from the premiere will go to support the DNA Doe Project. And after the screening, Amy Baker and the filmmakers Jason Greer and Vanessa Ciccarelli took questions from the audience. You can watch that in full on our website and Facebook page. The documentary, by the way, has already won several awards at film festivals across the country. And if you'd like to watch the in-depth interview we did with Amy, Jason, and Vanessa in our studio a couple of weeks ago, you can find that as well at mountainlake.org.